All right, guys. So today, it's gonna be a cool day. Uh, I'm testing something out on the Super today. Uh, hopefully it looks good and it works, and if it does, I'll be buying it off the Shelby. Bad news about my friend's Shelby. It was making too much power that the engine blew. And I have the video on my phone and all that. I'm gonna ask him if it's okay if I upload it. Um, he was okay with telling me people that it blew up. I was suddenly told, like my friends and now I'm posting on YouTube, and I, I rarely get views, so I mean, it doesn't really matter. But yeah, he blew his engine on a Shelby GT500. I think it's making like high sevens to the wheel or low sevens. And yeah, it's just, he needs a fully rebuild now. He's selling his wheels and uh, that's what I'm gonna be doing right now. I'm gonna be putting on some B-locks on the back of the Super to see how they look. And if everything looks good, I'll be buying them off of him and then uh, just testing it, doing some little pulls to see if it slips or anything. Just, I really hope the trans and diff can really handle it. I mean, I've seen people run the welds on Supras with stock trans and weld. I mean, uh, stock trans and stock diff. They do good. So, uh, I think he knows I'm here, but I'm gonna go ahead and get out and wait for him in his garage. So, this is what we're gonna be test fitting on the Supra. Some b locks by Porch Star. Hope they fit. Alright, so first wheel's off, second wheel's on. Damn. That looks real good. It might just fit, dude. Yeah? It's gonna be a tight fit. Like How close is it to the brake? It's close. That's how mine was. Oh, yeah. okay. But okay, never mind. Move, like, yeah. Damn. Alright, moment of truth. Yeah, look at this jack. So smooth. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, wow. Dude, I think it fits better than the Vertini's. Dang. It's so fat on your computer. Dude, I know, right? Dang. Not bad. Try it out and see if there's any noise. Let's see if it rubs. All right. Because it no. doesn't sound like it's scratching it. No? no. All right, you want me to park it back up? Yeah. yeah? Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and put the other one on. This one didn't rub and the brakes fit perfect, surprisingly. So I guess I'm gonna be buying these if everything goes good after the test drive. Oh. Alright, so the Supra's done, but I need to do a conversion kit for these because these are lug nuts are better. Than the ones I have but this is how it's looking you guys already saw from the left side fitment is pretty good I like it and then the right side so we're never gonna go a test drive make sure everything's good and honestly I love the look so now I just gotta give them the money hopefully by the end of the month and then good to go this is getting a whole new look it's getting new wheels new tires He's gonna be going with the rebuilt motor with the Kenny. I think a Kenny. I think that's what he said. Kenny Bell. And I think his goal is to be at a thousand wheel horsepower with the Shelby. Huh, Freddy? A thousand wheel horsepower? Yes, sir. <laughs> hey, are you cool if I post the the video? Yeah. All right. Alright guys, so I just got back from the test drive and the car hooked good, the car performed good. Surprisingly, no wheel spin and Freddie made me do a first gear pull and that was intense. So right now I'm gonna go um, off-roading in his little, I don't, I don't know what those things are called, to be honest. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave the, the camera here because I don't want anything to happen to it, but I'm gonna take my camera to take photos and then when I get back, I'll continue the vlog or probably end it, we'll see. Um, but that's the look right now. I just need to wait for my sponsorship to be done for Teeny. 
and then I'll probably get 19s through them, or I'll probably look at some uh, TEs maybe. But we'll see, this is the look for right now, for a while, because I need to save money. <laughs> You know what, on second thought, I'll just bring you guys along, honestly. I don't think anything will happen to the camera. I'll try not to vlog uh, with it while we're out there, because it is pretty bumpy over there. But uh, the news with the Shelby, he's letting me upload the video, so I'm going to show you guys what happened. Basically, he was uh, doing a second to fifth gear, or third gear to fifth gear pull, and the car just completely blew up, like engine-wise. The smoke came out, it was left the smoke trail. Um, the hole is down here somewhere. I don't want to get underneath the car. But uh, I think he has pictures, so he'll probably send them to me. But yeah, this car, it's like leaking oil and all that. And it got on the intake, so I think the supercharger might be done. That's why he's upgrading it. But right now, we're going to go off-roading. Take some photos of that, because this is his little toy. And yeah. And we came to the highest part. He let me drive it, and this thing's freaking crazy. We went up this big mountain right here. Sketch, huh? <laughs> Damn. We've really been up to all that already. We did already? Yeah. Damn. What else is there? Like, it's crazy, huh? What's all that over there? Like, all those little work trucks over there, too. Over there, there's people. Oh, really? They have it off. Oh, they do have it blocked off. What the freak right there? So it's workers, then, right? Because I don't think people would actually live there. Huh. All right, so I'm finally back home from off-roading. Right now, I'm gonna go ahead and start editing the photos for Freddy, and start posting my photos of the Supra with the new B-Locks. And that's the end of the YouTube video. Um, I'm gonna be doing a challenge soon with my girlfriend who can eat the spiciest food. I don't know exactly when we're doing that because I'm not a big fan of spicy food. I really can't handle spicy food, but uh, we're gonna do that soon. All right, all right. Back up. <laughs> yeah, but um, anyways, instead of the vlog, I'm gonna go ahead and start editing this and upload it soon. Uh, probably tomorrow I'll upload it. Um, my friend Shelby's gonna be going through a lot of process. It's gonna be gone for like, I don't even know, I wanna say six months or more. Maybe less, could be more, I don't know. Um, that's all I'm gonna say. I don't wanna get too much into detail, but uh, if you guys wanna know anything about it, you can follow him on his Instagram, I'm gonna put it down below. And you guys can check out his page, check the rebuild process and everything. It is going to be a faster car. Worst comes to worst though, he did say he would sell it once it's done to get a Z06. But uh, I hope not because I'm not a big fan of those cars. Unless it's a C8. But yeah, that's the end of the YouTube video. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe on what you guys want to see next. And I'll go ahead and uh, try my hardest to do that for you guys.